Think twice about picking up your phone while driving with an increase in crashes. That's the most important because of distracted drivers. The state is now upping penalties for those caught in the act. News 12's Shosh Bedrosian breaks down the new law and the fines you can now face. For the thousands of drivers that hit the road daily in Connecticut, the state says that any given moment, about 660,000 drivers across America are using a device behind the wheel. To be texting while you're driving, I think, is insane. And with an increase in traffic fatalities by distracted drivers, the state is making you pay up with heftier fines. And we want it to be a little bit steeper than it currently is, because clearly our current laws aren't doing the trick. A first-time offense will cost you $200, and in increase in $50. A second offense will be $375, which was previously $300. And if you're caught a third time or more, you'll be slapped with a $625 fine, an increase in $125. Wow, that's a lot. It's a big increase. I think for an infraction like that, it should be even higher than $150, maybe $500. For Bridgeport native Tony Bavides, the topic hits close to home. I could identify with traffic accidents. I lost my wife in a traffic accident in Palm Beach two and a half years ago. Bavides says his wife Sandra was walking her dog when she was hit by a car. They have to make it so high that people just aren't going to do it. In Connecticut alone, the state reports 5,000 crashes were caused by distracted drivers in 2020 and because of it, state and local police are cracking down on enforcement. It only takes a split second of looking away from the road to make a mistake and that mistake in many cases can be fatal. It can be fatal for yourself or it could be fatal for a cyclist or a pedestrian on the road. In Westport, Shosh Bedrosian, News 12, Connecticut. Drivers who are 16 and 17 are prohibited from using a cell phone at any time, even hands-free.